Boom. Uh, hey, how's everyone doing? Uh, just something a little bit different. Uh, just something a little bit different. I am uh, just in a different part of my garage. Just in a different part of my garage. But I have my, uh, got my microphone set back up here. And I know it's late, 1030. We'll just see if anyone pops in. We'll just see if anyone's going to pop in. But uh, I am just in practice mode right now. I'm just in practice mode right now, and I was just telling, I was just telling Jen not too long ago. This is I, I love this. I love this garage. It's not cold in here. No, just let me refresh my page, and this is not on. Uh, I think this is just my my regular page. I don't think this is on my Matt TV page. We'll soon find out, though. I know it's late. Uh, I'm just going to come in here. I'm just going to read one script. Here I am. Oh, it is on my own personal page. Cool. Uh, I'm just going to read one script. Um, I'm on the edgestudio.com. No, it's not on. A, no, I, I specifically did not do it on Matt TV. This is just on my own personal page. Uh, I just have my microphone set up um, because the next chapter for me the next chapter for me is going to be uh, this voiceovers so I'm just looking at my page right now I have my laptop up in front of me and I'm gonna read you uh, Laura I guess I'll read you the script here I don't know who else is in here uh, but if you really want to, and this is always good for people who maybe have to get up and do public speaking and whatnot, there's a website out there, uh, and I'm on it right now, it's edstudio.com, and there are like 5,400 uh, 5, scripts on there. So that's where I go and do my practice, and I was talking the other night about uh, some of the, in, in those 5,400 scripts, there are like 26 subcategories that I feel that are in my wheelhouse, you know, the narrations, you know, documentaries and corporate videos and political stuff and da 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 da. I feel all that stuff is uh, in my wheelhouse. So, that being said, uh, hello Judy, how are you? Whew. And I'm fighting this sinus cold too, and it's so bizarre. Not really, I think I actually called it, I think I actually called the sickness towards me because I was kind of being cocky. I was being cocky and saying that uh, that I, I never get sick. Very, very rarely do I get sick. But when I do get sick, it's usually just a sinus cold, and that's what I'm dealing with. So, I wanted to go into uh, wanted to go into the city today. Uh, Dave Keenan's roommate Gertie is off to Columbia. Uh, I think he's leaving on maybe Monday. But my window of opportunity may have been may have been tonight. But I was just too ill. My head was just like pounding, like a boom, boom. I'm like, not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. So anyway. Uh, I'm just going to read a script for you, uh, actually more for me, but this is, uh, uh, anyone who's seen my show, this is an outlet for me. I like just getting in here and uh, I could just talk and talk and talk. If I had one of those big uh, coolers of water, I would just drink water and talk all day. That's the goal. Mm, that's the goal. Okay, so I'm just going to, uh, I'm just going to leave my Facebook page and I'm going to go to a section on edgestudio.com. It's a biography. It's just a quick biography on uh, Christopher, Christopher Reeve. Yes, yeah, a quick biography on Christopher Reeve. So just I just want to narrate this for you. So I'm going to be looking at my laptop here. So uh, again, this is a, this is a biography. This is a a subcategory of voiceovers that I am pursuing. Uh, I put everything's on the table. Just give me five minutes in a booth. Just give me five minutes. Give me five minutes. I can do a lot. Uh, just let me catch my breath. I don't know why I'm running out of air. But I'm speaking into my, uh, this is an Apex 460 microphone. Uh, I absolutely love this microphone. And I just have uh, simple free software that I use, uh, Audacity, which is a free download. You can, this laptop, I'm just so grateful that it still works. This laptop is like 10 years old. Uh, but really only I just use it for recording, but I haven't uh, like I said I got my microphone set up here in my garage and uh, so there's this is not a sound uh, proof booth by any means, but 
obviously it's uh, well it's 25 to 11 out here so the traffic does die down a little bit okay so just let me read this for you this is just off uh, at studio.com and you can come and go as you please it doesn't really matter I'm just I just had the camera on and uh, maybe this will benefit someone who is uh, getting in you know for those that are just getting into voiceovers uh, the best thing you can do the best practice and some of the stuff that I was taught is just when you get the the daily paper all the junk mail that you get just start reading everything out loud all the advertisements out loud when you're driving down the road and you see a sign read it like you would in an announcement and that's uh but for those that want to get into doing voiceovers my advice to you right off the beginning is just start reading stuff out loud read it out loud and follow the punctuation but i uh i read differently i read differently i don't read like everyone else anyway just let me read this for you <clears throat> And I'm battling a little bit of a sinus cold here, but you get the idea. The whole world held its breath when Christopher Reeve struggled for life on Memorial Day, 1995. On the third jump of a riding competition, Reeve was thrown headfirst from his horse in an accident that broke his neck and left him unable to move or breathe. In the years following the accident, Reeve raised much awareness and money for spinal cord research. And in 1998, he penned the heartbreaking, funny, and courageous autobiography, Still Me. As we look back, you'll hear from the Man of Steel himself through interview footage as he talks about his early success on Broadway opposite the legendary Katherine Hepburn. And later, the adventure of filming Superman on the streets of New York and how the movie made him a star. With dignity and sensitivity, he describes the journey he has made physically, emotionally, spiritually. This is the determined, passionate story of one man, a gifted actor and star. Uh, it's so bizarre when you, it doesn't matter how many times you do a voiceover, for, for me, anyway, I get really tight in the lungs. So that's a good exercise for me. I got to loosen up a little bit. <sighs> Whew, I feel like there's a clamp. Right now, I feel like there's a clamp around me, and it's so bizarre. So bizarre. Uh, but doing stuff like that, uh, when that script there, I would read that over... I would read that over a dozen times. I would read that over a dozen times. You hit record... And you just let it go, right? And you read that same script for maybe 10, 15 minutes. I do anyway. And then you get rid of the first 11 minutes. So if you, like seriously, you got to get into a groove. You got to get into a groove when you're doing stuff like this. You just can't be happy with, uh, with the first take. But it, I have the same energy right now. I have the same energy that I normally do when I'm in... When I'm doing live auditions, when you ha actually have the opportunity to go into the city and to their, you know, professional setting with the engineers and uh, the casting director, and if you're lucky enough for the client, uh, those are good days. They're all good days. Uh, just the opportunity to go in and uh, be animated, be animated, right? You go in there and you give it 110%. It's always better if they are asking you to dial it down a bit because it's easier to tone down your energy than it is to go in a little bit flat foot and then you got to bring your energy up so so yeah that's just my advice that's my advice but yeah I, I guess i still have to uh and i'm not even auditioning for anyone that's the bizarre thing i'm not auditioning for anybody I'm not even recording this. I mean, it's being recorded on here, but I don't have my audacity going. But I have the... Uh, I don't know. I, I feel like I need to go for a run or something. I feel like I need to go for a run. <clears throat> but with the technology, uh, there is no harm in turning the phone on, right? It's 20 to 11 here on the West Coast. And again, this is on my personal page too, so uh, not that that makes any difference. Not, not, you know. 
Uh, but my main focus, uh, you know, uh, fortunately, fortunately, uh, I find myself unemployed right now, which is uh, actually, in spite of everything else that's happened, I'm okay with that. I'm okay. Yeah, I'm okay with that. So, uh, it's all good. But the next, uh, the next chapter is this, right here. I'm going to spend my days in front of a microphone, uh, getting paid to read scripts, and hopefully be in a position real soon where I can... I want to write my own stuff. I have this, the phone that this is being recorded on. There's so much, so many notes and concepts and one-liners and observations on my phone that I can't wait to uh, bring to life in some form or another, like uh, animation. Uh, Dave Keenan and I have talked about, you know, some of the things that we talk about, putting it to animation. Why not? It's all just a matter of finding individuals who have who are like yeah that's a great idea let's do that let's work together so i'm looking for people who want to work together uh, i'm a i'm a building block i'm a i'm a solid i'm a solid building block i have a good foundation i know exactly what i'm going to do i just i'm just looking for other people to to bond and just make the the building block uh, it needs to grow i am the ground floor i am the ground floor so i want to see and i've said it many times i want to see how many people who want to come along for the for the adventure for the adventure uh, all the sirens yeah well where we are here, if they need to get to Highway 99 or King George, this is a direct route. They just go right down to Marine Drive or 8th Ave and off they go. Yeah, this is a, it's booming. There's a lot of, there's a lot of construction going on here. A lot of construction going on. Um, I just want to do a couple more. So that was my, that was like a narration for Christopher Reeve, but it, this is where I really, this is the direction that I really want to go in. This will be, this is the commercial section. And again, anyone who is listening, who is thinking of doing voiceovers, just start practicing reading junk mail. <laughs> junk mail. Uh, imaging. Imaging is something I know I could do. Imaging is something that you... Like TV imaging, radio imaging, all the guys that come in in between. Announcements and stuff like that. I got the following is a special presentation on ESPN on ABC. Home of the, okay, home of the city BCS national championship. The following is a special presentation of ESPN on ABC, home of the city BCS National Championship. See, I feel that's in my wheelhouse, and you have a good engineer, and you're speaking into like a $10,000 microphone with some effects. They're going to make you sound like real good, but I think I'm halfway there. I think I'm halfway there. The following is a special presentation of ESPN on ABC, home of the city BCS National Championship. Or like, bring it up, man. The following is a special presentation of ESPN on ABC, home of the city BCS National Championship. Go bigger, stay home. Go bigger, stay home, nah. I don't know. Uh, am I looking for jobs? Yes, I'm always looking for jobs. I'm always looking. But here's the thing, I don't... Uh, Yes, I'm looking for jobs. I'm always looking for jobs. But I want to do voice jobs. Uh, I have my agent and whatnot, but uh, whatever. I need to... Uh, I lost my glasses. Well, you need to get into a groove, right? That's why I would read that line. I'd read that line 20 times. You know, you can go into a studio session and you might that might be your one line. And you're there for an hour. 
or whatever, however long it takes. Yeah, I like that gun. That's, that's it's good. Uh, what else do we have here? But that's where the money is, and that's for me. That is the incentive. Like movie trailers and stuff like that. I know there's only a handful of people that do that stuff, but don't. No one will ever tell me what I can and cannot do, or what I'm limited to when it comes to voiceovers. That's just not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure of the old c capabilities. I don't need effects. I don't need effects. Everyone gets them, but like a. Don't settle for half the rock, get it all. Rock 100.5. That's kind of a weird call. The cat. Don't settle for half the rock, get it all. Rock 100.5. The cat. The cat. The c -c -c cat. <laughs> settle now. Um, uh, what is this? Way better hits. This see, this doesn't even make sense here. I don't. It's almost like they're they're uh, slamming their own stuff. These three and many more way better hits coming up right after this product information, especially for you. In sixty seconds, the most requested hit of the week. Uh, these three and many other way better hits coming coming up, coming up. <laughs> These three and many other way better hits coming up right after this product information, especially for you. In 60 seconds, the most requested hit of the week. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. And they like, uh, okay, Mr. Grant, uh, do it again. Do it this way. Do it slower. Blah, blah, blah. And I'd be like, great, let's do it. I got you for an hour. Uh, you're talking about it. We're talking about it. News Talk 77. News Talk 77, WABC. You're talking about it. We're talking about it. News Talk Radio, 77, WABC. Oh, my goodness. Get me in a chair. Get me in a studio. Live from WTXL, Tallahassee. This is ABC 27 News at 6. Live from WTXL, Tallahassee. This is ABC 27 News at 6. My goodness. Uh, this is your weather authority. Fox 8 News at 9 starts right now. <laughs> and, and you notice that the uh, everyone's voice goes gets deeper at night, right? Everyone's voice gets a little bit deeper at night. Change. Uh, I'm just have... I'm just in another part of my garage, Nick. Um, hey, don't diss. Hey, this, I, I'm not even in my, I'm in my garage. I just got things turned around. You don't like the, you don't like my backdrop? You don't like the Matt TV in the background? It hurts. What's going on, Nick? No, I just, I just have my, uh, I just have, this is just like a, a screen set up behind me. That's all. You don't like the Matt TV logo above me? In big capital letters. I see. Don't like um, yeah, but I'm just standing up in the table. I'm just doing this to record. I gotta go sit on the couch. Yes, I see that you don't have a phone. <laughs> it looks adult-like? Okay. Well, I'm seeing stuff in the garage there. Okay. Uh, found my thrill. Uh, let's, uh, Nick, you might be interested in this website here. Uh, edstudios.com. There's like 5,400 scripts. It's pretty easy. Go in, create an account. And there's like a script library. So that's where I am right now. I'm just reading some different things on here. Let's look at the public service announcements. As we approach 11 o'clock here on the south coast of British Columbia. Broke some records. Broke some records uh, for the month of January with rain. 24 days of rain in a 31-day calendar, January. Uh, do, 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 do. Um. 
So how do kids get alcohol? From legal aged friends and even siblings? Talk with your kids and get a free copy of Let's Keep Talking at MillerBrewing.com. Live responsibly. Miller Brewing Company, Milwaukee, Wisconsin. How do kids get alcohol? From legal aged friends and even siblings? Talk with your kids and get a free copy of Let's Keep Topping. <laughs> Let's Keep Topping. Okay. See, getting a little closer to the mic, it just changes everything, right? It changes the, the mood. It changes the mood. Uh, but you're, you're getting a whole different sound than what I'm getting because I'm speaking into this microphone here, hearing it through here. So it's much smoother here. Smoother. Um, yeah, I saw that you were going to do that. Yeah, writing a script for a story you narrated. Yeah, I remember doing that. That was quite a while ago. That actually has quite a few views, which is pretty nice. It's a good story. It's a great, great story. I like reading the comments. I like being able to uh, scare people just by telling them a story, like just with, uh, just with words. If you can scare someone with words, it's great. There's no better feeling. Uh, let's do another PSA here. <laughs> okay, and again, these are coming from uh, edgestudios.com. There's like 5,400 scripts on there. So anyone who is ever thinking of getting into the voiceover world, uh, my advice to you right now is start by reading all the junk mail, all the advertisements in the junk. Anything you can read, stops, or not stop signs, but traffic, whatever, any billboards, whatever you can read, start reading it. Uh, and this is just a cold read here on allergies. This is a PSA. Do you know what these items have in common? They can kill people who are severely allergic to them. Things as simple as peanuts, milk, eggs, and shellfish can cause a severe allergic reaction called anaphylaxis. As many as one out of seven people may be at risk for anaphylaxis. Other causes include insect stings, antibiotics, and latex. Are you or someone you love at risk? Be prepared. Completely avoiding an allergen is impossible. There are treatments that reverse the symptoms of a severe allergic reaction. If you or someone in your family has had any of these symptoms after contact with items like these, talk to your doctor. Hmm, that's pretty good advice. That's pretty good advice. And cold reads are, I, I don't recommend uh, thank you, John. I appreciate that, man. I really do. Yeah, it's... Yeah. No, thanks, John. I appreciate that. We gotta get together for coffee. We need to get together for coffee. There's lots going on, man. Uh, January was a bit of a gong show. January was a bit of a gong show. But there's a lot of, uh, a lot of love in this house and a lot of optimism, and we're all looking forward to, uh, doing some healing and moving on. Never, never going back. No steps backwards. Just progressing forward. So I appreciate that. But yeah, let's get together for a coffee. Let's do it. Let's get together. Uh, okay, I want to do a PSA. I want to do a PSA. Everyone's pretty happy with the <laughs> with the way the studio looks, even though it's just turned around and randomly set up somewhere. But I love, I love this garage. I can do my show in here. My dartboard is in here. So I'm just going to scroll down a bit, and uh, you can hang out for as long as you want. You can come and go. I, most of the people in here are probably on the West Coast anyway, because everyone else is probably sleeping. Probably sleeping. Uh, what do we have here? Hmm. Uh, here's something here on uh, the Golden Gate Bridge. Ooh, I like this one. May 27th, 1937. As evening descends on a chorus of oohs and ahs, where the night before stood only blackness, an icon of human accomplishment now illuminates the sky, and a new era of connectivity and commerce is ushered in with celebration and fireworks. It was at that moment that the Golden Gate Bridge became an integral part of Bay Area life, as it remains to this day, an everyday reminder that the Bay Area is a place where nothing is impossible and dreams become reality. 
The Golden Gate Bridge and Wells Fargo each continue to play leading roles in the growth and development of the Bay Area. And we're honored to help bring the celebration of the Golden Gate Bridge 75th anniversary to life. To learn more, visit ggb75.wellsfargo.com. The Golden Gate Bridge and Wells Fargo, built in the Bay Area. That's a cold read. That was a cold read, man. That was, uh, that was all right. That was, that was all right. Well, that's what I thought anyway. That's okay. No smoking. Uh, what's this one here? Uh, if you make time to talk to your kids about not smoking, your words will go with them wherever they go. So even if you're not there, your influence can be. For information and advice to help you talk to help you talk to your kids about not smoking, visit our Parent Resource Center at uh, www.philipmorrisusa.com. If you make time to talk to your kids about not smoking, your words will go with them wherever they go. So even if you're not there, your influence can be. For more information and advice to help you talk to your kids about not smoking, visit our Parent Resource Center at www.philipmorrisusa.com. Cool. Alrighty then. Oh my. Giggity. Uh, no worries, John, man. Everyone's got busy lives. I get it. Uh, all right. Uh, I'm hope you're I hope you're talking about the uh, that website, edstudios.com. Uh, I'm just gonna do one more. I'm just gonna do one more. I was gonna try and get some background music, but it would not allow it. I could hear it, but you wouldn't be able to hear it. Uh, let's go to let's go to the narrations for a minute. Narrations. Everybody knows. Sometimes we all say, listen to Tongue twisters? No. Internet audio? No. Uh, documentary? Let's try documentary. Let's just have a little look see. Let's have a little look see at the old. <laughs> look up. Way up. Um, let me see. 11 o'clock, 3 o'clock in the Woodstock area. I don't imagine anyone's getting up yet. I might just stay on here. I might just stay. Ooh, the Appalachian Trail. Too big of a word. <laughs> not really. Really? No, not really. What year was that? Okay. Uh, is it Kolniski? See, I'd have to have, I'd have to have a backup on that. I'd have to make a phone call. Border Raiders. The Bullfrogs. Hmm. <laughs> See if I can educate you on Bullfrogs. Uh, contrary to popular opinion, frogs aren't just selective eaters feasting only on flies. Take the bullfrog, for example. They'll eat spiders, scorpions, rodents, snakes, fish, and just about anything else that passes in front of them. So contrary to popular opinion, frogs aren't just selective eaters feeding only on flies. Take the bullfrog, for example. They'll eat spiders, scorpions, rodents, snakes, fish, and just about anything else that passes in front of them. See, there's so many different ways to read it, right? Mm. That's why I could just come in here and practice, practice. We're talking about practice, not the game, not the game. Practice. <laughs> How many was that, like 17 times or something? In that? No, it was more than that. More than that. Uh, we we'll get a little thing here on. No, we don't. You got to scan through. You got to scan through. Sometimes it's okay to uh, hear that. I know what that word there. I've never seen it. Never seen that word before. 
It's not about the audience all the time. It's about the content of the show, right? Right. Uh, let's just go down here a bit more. I think I did this one. Uh, okay, let's, I'm just going to read this. <clears throat> you can follow along if you choose or not. For the wildebeest. For the wildebeest. It, the wilde. The wildebeest. For the wildebeest, the grass is life. But it's also cover for the enemy. Well, that's just too long. and <laughs> scary. I couldn't talk like that for the whole time. I could, but I'm not going to. I need something a little bit. I need something a wee bit shorter. The guy of a thousand accents, guaranteed to do everyone awful. How's your accent? Awful. I don't even know if you can hear me. I may be speaking so low that no one can hear me. I don't know. Let me go back to my comments here. See what's going on. Do do do. Have a good night, Laura. We are on the path of healing. We're on the path of healing. Uh, but thank you. Do, 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 do. It's after 11. The sun. Compared with the billions of other stars in the universe, the sun is unremarkable. But for Earth and the other planets that revolve around it, the sun is a powerful center of attention. It holds the solar system together, pours life, giving heat and energy to the Earth. Compared with the billions of other stars in the universe, the sun is unremarkable. But for Earth and the other planets that revolve around it, the sun is a powerful center of attention. It holds the solar system together, pours life, giving heat, light, and energy to the Earth. It's kind of a messed up script. I, that's kind of crazy. Tuscany? Are you really? Uh, so again, I'm just here on edgestudios.com. Uh, I just have my microphone set up in the garage and a screen behind me and phone in front of me, and I'm just in here playing around. And I thought I would record it for some reason. <laughs> What's a good section? Uh, medical and pharmaceutical? Do, 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 do. What's going on? Okay, so Nick now knows about edstudios.com. Excellent. Good stuff. Good. But I would. Okay. Mm, let's go into this. Uh, so right now, Nick, I'm in the medical section, I believe. So there's going to be a lot of big words, uh, which I'll probably skip over because it just scares me sometimes. Uh, many common health problems can put your cardiovascular system at risk. High blood pressure puts stress on the heart and other major organs. High cholesterol can clog important blood vessels. Uncontrollable diabetes affects how well your heart works and, like all of these conditions, can lead to heart attack, stroke, and severe kidney disease. That's why it's so important to keep these cardiovascular conditions controlled. Each one of them has a specific treatment goal, an actual number you should be trying to reach. Do you know yours? If not, talk to your doctor. Find out what goals are and what you can do to reach them. Because a healthy heart is, is oh, and he, gets, he can't get to the last sentence because a healthy heart is within your grasp today. <clears throat> Mm. 
Many common health problems can put your cardiovascular system at risk. High blood pressure puts pressure on your heart and other major organs. High cholesterol can clog important blood vessels. Uncontrollable diabetes affects how well your heart works and, like all these conditions, can lead to heart attack, stroke, and severe kidney disease. No, no, <laughs> that's not how it's going to go. <clears throat> Many common health problems can put your cardiovascular system at risk. High blood pressure puts stress on your heart and other major organs. High cholesterol can clog important blood vessels. Uncontrollable diabetes affects how well your heart works and, like all these conditions, can lead to heart attack, stroke, and severe kidney disease. That's why it's so important to keep these cardiovascular conditions controlled. Each one of them has a specific treatment goal, an actual number you should be trying to reach. Do you know yours? If not, talk to your doctor. Find out what your goals are and what they can do and what you can do to reach them. Because a healthy heart is within your grasp today. <laughs> oh, I could read all day. I'm serious. I could read all day. Uh, let's just scroll down here. Exercise. Ooh. Do, 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 moving right along. We're not going to talk about exercise. Oh, low battery. So I got, I have 10% battery left, so I'm just going to stay here until my battery fizzles away. <clears throat> uh, let's quickly do this one here. Uh, today in the United States, uh, today in the United States, over 10 million people need help with their daily activities from simply eating or bathing to round-the-clock nursing. 70% live at home and desperately want to remain there if help is available. Home call exists to enable them to remain at home in comfort with privacy and independence. Years ago, home call recognized that all across the country there was a growing need for services that make it feasible for older persons to remain in their homes rather than make the heartbreaking move to an institution. So we supplied homemaking services such as meal preparation, light housekeeping, and personal care. Okay, so that's a cool one. That's all right. Today in the United States, over 10 million people need help with their daily activities, from simply eating or bathing to round-the-clock nursing. So I might get a little bit closer and we'll make it a little more personal. Today in the United States, over 10 million people need help with their daily activities, from simply eating or bathing to round-the-clock nursing. 70% live at home and desperately want to remain there if help is available. Home call exists to enable them to remain at home in comfort with privacy and independence. Years ago, home call recognized that all across the country, there was a growing need for services that make it feasible for older persons to remain in their homes rather than making that heartbreaking move to an institution. So we supplied homemaking services such as meal preparation, light housekeeping, and personal care. Do, 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 do. I'm way more relaxed than I was at the beginning. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, one more. I'm just going to do one. I may do many more, but I'm just going to do one more for what I'm doing here right now, and then I'm going to turn it on. Uh, let's go back to the top. Go back to the top, maybe pop into the commercial once again. Let's see what's happening in the business department. Let's see what's going on in business. 60 second explainer. Don't have time. American Century, American Express. Oh, this is such a good website, Nick. I hope you appreciate it. I hope you uh, get some use out of it. Because it's all free, right? You can record this and do whatever with it. No one's going to bother you. No one's going to bother. Charles Schwab, 
coast to coast. Coast to coast, what's that all about? I like it. Oh, I like it a lot. Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah. You got nothing to lose. Comcast. <clears throat> Meet Bob. Like 95% of car shoppers, he uses his computer, smartphone, and tablet to shop for his next car. A few years ago, he could have reached Bob through traditional means such as direct mail, TV or radio, and newspaper ads. Today, that simply isn't enough. According to Google, consumers visit 18, blah, 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 blah. No. Ooh, the New Year's resolution diet. The first real date in two years. Nope. Okay, I'm just in here messing around, though. so glad that I'm not working tomorrow. You know what I mean? Uh, Jennifer. Hello, Jennifer. How are you? What continent are you on? I want to say you're in Europe, maybe. I don't know. Paul. Paul, what's going on? Uh, I'm just in here messing around. I'm getting ready for the next chapter. Not the next chapter. My, a, new, a new book. And I'm not writing a book. But, you know, uh, figuratively, I guess. Being laid off was one of the best things that ever happened to me so far. Just timing. Um, okay, let's do this one here. Only from Sportsnet. Snet. That is. Telecom USA. <clears throat> the Home Depot is more than a store. We offer free workshops and uh, for do it yourself, you and yourself first for all ages and experience levels. Whether it's supplies, tools, or just a little advice. We've got you covered, so stop procrastinating. Come to the Home Depot and start checking off some of those items on that to-do list. The Home Depot. You can do it. We can help. That's a cold read. Uh, the Home Depot is more than a store. The Home Depot is more than a store. We offer free workshops for do-it-yourselfers of all ages and experience levels. Whether it's supplies, tools, or just a little advice. We've got you covered, so stop procrastinating. Come to the Home Depot and start checking off some of those items on that to-do list. The Home Depot. You can do it. We can help. You can do it. We can help, man. We can certainly help you out, my friend. Come on in here. What do we want to build next? What do we want to build next? That's the question. Every day when you have the most advanced tools, you want to make something with them. Something that helps. Helps you safeguard your shores. Helps someone see through a wall of fire. Helps those nowhere near the right doctor stand a chance. What? Technology can do that. It cold. Take a... No, see, there's spelling errors, and now those words don't make sense. Wachovia. Wachovia. The wedding channel. channel what is iPad <clears throat> what is iPad iPad is thin iPad is beautiful iPad goes anywhere and lasts all day there's no right way or wrong way it's amazingly powerful it's magical you already know how to use it it has nearly 200,000 apps and counting a world of websites in your hands it's video, photos, more books than you could read in a lifetime. It's already a revolution, and it's only just begun. <laughs> okay. All righty then. <laughs> All righty then. What is iPad? iPad is thin. iPad is beautiful. iPad goes anywhere and lasts all day. There's no right way or wrong way. It's amazingly powerful. It's magical. You already know how to use it. 
It has nearly 200,000 apps and counting. A world of websites in your hands. It's video, photos, more books than you could read in a lifetime. It's already a revolution, and it's only just begun. <laughs> I like that one. That was okay. Uh, the blues ain't nothing but a good man feeling bad. And it seems like there ain't no better way to get feeling bad than looking at my big old monthly cell phone bill. What? But then I discovered Wireless World and their solution to uh, big old cell phone bills is now instead a singing of the blues. Uh, I don't know who wrote that, but back to the drawing board, please. Uh, can you make it a little less difficult to say? Ah, that'd be a good start. Uh, help and beauty aids. Everybody knows some aids on mistletoe. I love Christmas. <laughs> I love Christmas time. And it's so far away. It's so far away. Okay. Let's go back. I might have an old Matt TV a thon, but this is not Matt TV. Okay, we are in the uh, Health and Beauty Aids. Health and Beauty Aids. Advil. For fast, effective relief, Advil goes to work right at the site of the minor arthritis pain. It keeps pain away for hour. It keeps pain away hour after hour. And it's gentler on your stomach than aspirin. In fact, nothing has proven more effective or lasting, longer lasting than Advil. Advil Advanced Medicine is pain. Uh, Advil, Advanced Medicine for Pain. Oh, that's what it is. <laughs> yeah. For fast, effective relief, Advil goes to work right at the site of minor arthritis pain. It keeps pain away hour after hour, and it's get and it's gentler on your stomach than aspirin. For fast, for fast, effective relief. <laughs> for fast, effective relief, Advil goes to work right at the site of minor arthritis pain. Advil goes, uh, Advil goes to work right at the site of minor arthritis pain. It keeps pain away hour after hour. <laughs> That's getting painful. I need an Advil just to continue reading that script. You know what I mean? So let's move on. Let's get out of the A's, man. Uh, scrolling right down. Ooh, no. What do we have? Seinfeld? No. Uh, Claire, all natural instincts for healthy looking. Uh, for healthy looking color, trust your instincts. Natural instincts with 100% pure aloe, chamomile, and ginseng. It makes you it makes your hair look even shinier and healthier, looking like you colored it. Claire, all color wonderful. <laughs> no. For healthy looking color, trust your instincts. Natural instincts with 100% pure aloe, chamomile, and ginseng. It makes your hair look even shinier and healthier looking than before. Before you colored it. What? Come on now. No one talks like that. <laughs> no one talks like that. Uh, Crest Complete Deep Clean. New Crest Complete Deep Clean. You feel it working, so you know it's working. You feel it working, so you know it's working. And that means you already, that means you're ready for whatever the day brings. Unlike ordinary toothpaste, you feel a deeper clean. You're also protected. With New Crest Complete, you're now covered. You know you're covered. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> New Crest Complete Deep Clean. New Crest Complete Deep Clean. You feel it working, so you know it's working. And that means you're ready for whatever the day brings. Unlike ordinary toothpaste, you feel a deeper clean. You're also protected. With New Crest Complete. You're now, you know you're covered. What? Why can't I get that last one? New Crest Complete Deep Clean. You feel it working, so you know it's working. And that means you're ready for whatever the day brings. Unlike ordinary toothpaste, you feel a deeper clean. You're also protected. With New Crest Complete, you know you're covered. With New Crest Complete, you know you're covered. <laughs> covered. Come on now. Scroll down. Everybody knows. Nope. Mm, nope. I'm in a lot of. Uh, I guess you know this. 
beauty stuff, a lot of women would be voicing this stuff. A lot of women would be doing this. Everyone's, uh, everybody's always telling you how to clean things. Everyone's always telling you how to clean things. Your hair, your nails, your sink. Anybody ever tell you how to clean your ear? Well, I'm going to tell you. First, find an ear, then grasp a nice, soft Q-tip swab. Firmly, firmly, stroke gently. Careful, only on the outside. Ah, soft. Oh, and remember, never put anything inside your ear except your elbow. What? Uh, this is going to be the last bit because I, I need to, I know this is going to die. The phone is probably going to, and I won't be able to. Anyway, I'm just having some fun here. That's going to do it for me. I'm just practicing. I may be, a, uh, I have some free time tomorrow, so I may come in and do the same thing. Okay, uh, my name is Matthew. This is, this is not Matt TV, but it is, kind of. Uh, have a good night. Bye-bye now.